A Dublin paramedic is saying thank you to the heart surgeon who saved his life. 41 NBC's Andrew Willis spoke with Forrest Jones and Dr. Richard Harvey about why they're thankful on National Grateful Patient Day. They really thought, oh, at worst, maybe a stent, you know, it's probably going to be nothing. But that was not the case. Forrest Jones is no stranger to saving lives. As a paramedic, he says it's part of his job. But Jones didn't expect that one day his life would need to be saved. We really had no idea that I had anything wrong. What started out as headaches and fatigue raised concern for Jones after the results of his blood pressure and stress tests came back. His primary care provider performed a heart cath and discovered nearly 100% blockages in three major arteries of Jones's heart. After, he was referred to heart surgeon Dr. Richard Harvey of Piedmont-Macon Medical Center for bypass surgery. Even though Forrest was, you know, this major surgery, uh, we just had a piece about it that we were in good hands. Jones and his wife Allison, who is a registered nurse, were both scared. But the fear quickly went away thanks to Dr. Harvey's honesty and compassion. The initial contact with the patient for me is, is to be thorough and to answer any questions to try to alleviate the anxiety. When it was time for the surgery, Allison said she received frequent updates on Forrest's condition to reassure her that things were going well. Forrest says he feels blessed to have recovered from his surgery and is thankful to everyone who helped him along the way. Had I just continued to say, oh, it's fine, I don't need that heart cath or I don't need that stress test or whatever, then I probably wouldn't be sitting here. For Dr. Harvey, helping his patients through a difficult time in their lives and seeing their recovery is what makes his job rewarding. I've always loved doing this, and I, I do enjoy um, helping people. And so this is just kind of my calling, my path. In Macon, Andrew Willis, 41 NBC News. Dr. Harvey encourages anyone who may be experiencing abnormal symptoms to talk with their health care provider. Jones says he's had a smooth recovery process and is set to return to work in a few weeks.